Okay, here's the next part the battle her fay. The forces of Wu are quickly approaching. What are your orders? Wait a moment. We have orders from our lord. He said to bloody their nose. Then pull back and wait for reinforcements. The time for talk is over. Now we can move on to the planning. Alright, as always the intro. Despite superior numbers, Wan Shao is unable to take Guan Du, thanks to the strong defense put up by Cao Cao. However, Cao Cao noticing a weakness in Wan's defenses, orders his troops to attack quickly scattering the enemy forces and resulting in victory. With their spirits high, Wei looks to quash resistance from a frightened Wu. Soon Jian leads a large army and attacks the Wei territory. Cao Cao attempts to send reinforcements to the front line at Huan Castle, but they arrive too late. In the year 215, moving north, the Wu army arrives at Heifei. Hearing of Wu's attack, Cao Cao, following Zhang Liao's advice, agrees to send a unit to meet them. Will the counter-strike against Sun Jian prevail? Only time will tell. Alright, the equipment the same, the weapons the same, the items are the same. The bodyguards, the highest I could have is four, so that's, that's the most I'm going to use. Alright, the conditions are the same. Actually, Somewhat, because I don't think I have played this level yet with Soon Jian. Anyway, if Sao Sao is defeated, or Soon Jian enters enemy headquarters, or basically enemy headquarters to them, is our main headquarters. So if he does that, or Sao Sao dies, or if I die, we lose, it's a game over, and obviously to win is defeating Soon Jian. Anyway, the unit info, other than Soon Jian, there's really no other changes. And we already pointed out Zhou Yu, I already pointed out Dian Wei. And I don't think there's any more changes in this particular battle in general. So, that's pretty much it. We did the intro, so let's do it. Front line, retake the middle. That's the vital spot of the Wu army. Alright, the first thing we just did there was grab them some, make things easier on ourselves. Alright, the first thing we're going to do is assassinate Tai Chi Si. Uh, if you know how to do it, then it's really easy. I mean, it's a little tr I mean, I'm not saying it's a trick, but if you read the cutscene well enough, you know exactly what you need to do there. And why am I just fending off troops over here for? And why are they knocking me off my horse? And why is he coming into play now? Go! Alright. Let's get the Taishi C. Zhang Liao's over here. You have to keep him over here and you have to lure Taishi C into here. There's a little section. I'll touch anyone who stands in my way. Is he really wanting running away? Oh 
Oh, apparently this guy's smart. Why isn't it working? Do we really have to defeat this officer in here? I can't believe my health is really this low. I've got you now, Taishi Sing. Wait, I is hurt. There's no need to pursue. I still have so far to go. I just lost a bodyguard. Great. Taishi C dropped it somewhere. Good luck. Really? Really? Too many crossbows. They all gotta die. Every single one of them. Yeah, apparently that sword went somewhere. That silver sword. And apparently I can't find it. Hopefully Zhang Liao will retreat and does his thing. He will retreat and invade, well, will attack where, where Sun Jian is. Him doing that will come at a price. Gan Ning will appear and that's not good. Because he'll have a morale of 8 and he could actually really kill you even on the easiest mode if you don't know how to do it right. Well, if you know how to do it right as in dying, then yeah. Alright, let's kill Zhou Tai. Awesome, so he's gonna retreat. I think there's everybody now in Central Square. Okay, that crossbow needs to go. I don't care who you are. Wow! You know what? Screw using cross, uh, using bow and arrows. I'm just gonna kill him head on. Thank <laughs> you. 
Wow, why am I sucking today? Alright, now we're gonna go to the top right and defeat Lu Shun. Be very careful over here. There are millions of crossbows. Why do you discard your life so foolishly? I forgot it was Zhou Yu, not Lu Shun. We completed Zhou Yu's Musa mode. There is Sun John! What? It's Zeng Liao! Zeng Liao is here! Well done! Crush Wu for me! Ah. Attack! And now Gan Ning's here. If Wei has Zhang Liao, Wu has Gan Ning. Now is our chance to get them! Kill that traitor Kalkal! Attack! And be very careful. Make sure he doesn't get anywhere near headquarters. This is when he charges. Alright. Let's grab this Musa wine. The enemy has been reinforced. Yep, yeah, be really careful because I I forgot which Musa motor was. All of a sudden I see soon set right in front of the main gate. And well, let's just say I'm happy I saw him there before I got you got a chance to move anywhere near closer towards our main headquarters. All right, we're gonna defeat Gunning. Shu Huang just got crushed. Oh boy, this isn't good. They call me Gan Ning of the Bells. Let's play. Like I said, Gan Ning has a morale of eight, and that's the highest amount of morale you could actually get in a game. So be very careful. Even on easy, he's difficult. same time, keep a good look at your map because if soon Jian gets anywhere near here, you're in trouble. Reinforcements have arrived. Ah, they're here. It's not over. We're still in this. Don't worry about reinforcements. We will break through in one charge. Ow, 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 really? That not happening. He really just recovered every single bit of his health. Oh my god. 
That's part of the reason why I'm happy I skip this every single time. Where is soon Gian? Oh boy. Okay, get off your horse, thank you. I think this is tougher than Lubu. That's my personal opinion. Because, well, he has a morale of 8. And I just lost two of my bodyguards. And this crossbow's all over the place. Oh, shit. I, I am getting out of here. Oh my god, that is not cool. I'm almost dead. Yeah, this is one of those levels where I'm actually sucking at the moment. That's not enough. Oh man. And hopefully soon Jian doesn't get anywhere close. I mean, he's still down there, but down there can mean anything in in a few seconds. We must be triumphant. Alright, that should be enough. Okay, you really think he's gonna start attacking me once I come back? No, you're not. Okay, as long as nobody messes anything up with his troops, then I should be fine. And as long as he doesn't. Oh, God. This isn't happening. Alright, goodbye, good riddance. Alright, now these crossbow punks have to go. We must fight well. Wow, I love it for the fact that they scatter like that. Alright, you need to get lost. Thank you. Okay, now... I can always try to go after Lu Meng, but I am not chancing that. I'm just gonna go straight for Sun Jian. Because... Last time I, was, I got a little distracted, like I said before. I'm trying to figure out which Musa mode it was. I think it was Jaho Dune. Um, Soon Jian was, I mean, Soon Jian. Soon Tse was in uh, a good footsteps before entering the main headquarters, and we would have lost. I defeated an officer. And it looks like they defeated Lu Meng for me, so that works. Wrong bridge, really? I 
I think they both go in the same place. Well, that's gonna take a little bit of time. Yeah, we'll defeat Soon Jian. I'm not worried about Lu Su. I don't think it's gonna be a problem him going anywhere. Because everybody's just coming straight in. So we should be fine. This should do it. Unless he does a somersault back up in the air and flips over. Or if I hit the wrong troop a mistake. Much as Zhang Liao is a huge asset in this battle, he needs to get off that horse because that's bugging me. I'm getting hit. No! That's a win. A win that should have been a lot easier from the start, but I did way more than I should have. Which is partially the reason why if that Zhang Liao retreat thing doesn't happen, I'm always right by the commander and Gan Ning appears right there. All the way by where Cao Cao is and I'm over there, so I'm not going to even worry about facing him. It's going to go after the commander. It makes the battle 10 times easier. Anyway, whoa, that's a huge upgrade, but nothing really good. So, that's that. Oh, really? I had something higher than that? And we had the power scroll. Let's see all the items. Oh, we have a plus 21, okay. Alright, I'm not complaining then. <laughs> nah, but, alright, we... A KO count is sad for the fact that we only have 137 points for the 166 KOs. Um, nine officers defeated. Uh, we defeated nine officers. I said that twice, I know. Um, and we lost every single one of our bodyguards because Gan Ning. Like I said, I am glad every time they are on Alpha 4 that I always skip him. There's a reason why I skip him. I think he's a little more tougher than Lubu in my opinion. Especially since there's a lot of crossbows in that section. I'm not going to get much from this point, but never mind. Alright, well, we'll save. And there you have it. You can watch my gaming adventures, and I'll see you for the next part. Peace.